Hey guys, let's talk about High Note, one of the hottest new uh, tools and technologies for real estate agents. Uh, today, we have the good fortune of having Randy. Randy has created two real estate tools and technology services for real estate agents and has recently taken on High Note. He is the head of growth, so the best person to be talking about what's the latest and greatest on this tool, how to use it, what's going on in the community. So let's start first with Randy. You know, kind of what is your summary of the value and what this tool High Note is for real estate agents? Sure. So High Note is a way to deliver a bunch of information to a potential user to have the best customer experience. And when I saw this tool, I was really excited because, yes, it was created for real estate initially, but I've seen so many different use cases, right? We've all gotten emails with tons of information from attachments and presentations, videos, and all of these types of things, right? And the experience isn't that great, right? This is a way to combine it, put it all into one unified system and send it out. I say don't send an email anymore. Send a High Note. Customer experience is everything, right? People have bad customer experience, uh, customer service from time to time, but if the experience is overall good, they come back, right? So I say invest more in that deliver a high note versus just sending traditional emails. And it's very, very easy. So I'm excited yeah. to share the information today. Awesome. Yeah. And I think for most agents right now, if you are a listing agent and you're planning on going on a listing appointment anytime in the next six months, this is a tool you must take a look at. So, you know, stacking, you know, a video intro from you, your housing market video, which I'm asking everybody to do, a sample listing contract, you know, your marketing plan, your links to your different profiles. So that's, I mean, it's that visual experience and the accessibility to all of that information and data through that channel is amazing, right? Like that's like the no brainer of the century, right? And every single one of my coaching clients, Randy, who's gotten on and have really dug into the tool, they're very happy with what the experience is prior to showing up to the appointment because of that tool. So could you share with us a little bit today, um, what's happening inside the community? Are you guys evolving some of the tactics and the strategies and, and what are you doing with, with everybody who signed up? Sure. Yeah. So we have, so we have a private Facebook community, right? And it's, I mean, it's very engaged and people are sharing more than ever, right? So you have amazing listing agents, buyers agents, recruiters, right? Ops people, like just saying, hey, we use it for this. We're learning every day, Patrick, because of the community, right? Here we are thinking that it's for this and then we find out it's for that. And then we see the success. So, so much value is in the community, right? When you, when you develop these tools, you guys, the users are like, oh, I'm gonna use it for this or that. We're still learning every day and it's all because of the community. Just a few days ago, or maybe last week, I should say, we found out somebody was using it for onboarding new agents. Mm. We had no idea, but they had all of their onboarding docs, the process, their videos. They put it into a high note. And the review that they gave us, right, uh, this individual, let us know all the stuff that he was doing. And he's like, this has been a, like a lifesaver. It's because of that, right? We're learning. Yeah. And when people join community. Yeah, like, I think that way just, uh, you, you, that's so brilliant, right? Because, you know, as the owner of the high note, I can see for my new agent that if they opened it and how much time they spent on each one of the topics. So the feedback that you get and the accountability that that provides is brilliant. That's really good. I didn't even think about that too. I had no idea either, right? Like I, I did one um, with another, I did a video just recently with another client who recruited 200, like 211, 211 agents in 18 months. He doesn't cold call. He doesn't cold email. When he or his team members meet somebody that's interested in joining his team, they all have the link and they just text it to the person that's interested. Then from there, they use the analytics and they figure out what that person's interested in. Yeah. So every day, Patrick, we're learning. Like it, it's been a, it's been an awesome journey, and uh, I'm excited to continue to learn better use cases. Uh, better use cases, I should say. Yeah, and I think when I, I remember in the original conversation when I was talking to my wife about this, she's like, "Well, why would I just not use like a PowerPoint?" And, and it's really this multimedia experience, and to be able to, to utilize all of these different media experiences and present it in a very dy simple dynamic uh, package that can be delivered and, and you know sent via text, sent via an email, and then tracked. That's like, there's nothing else out on the market that gives that accessibility. Well, right? and, a PD and a PowerPoint's not interactive. Not right? at all. So like, you know, everybody has this in their back pocket. So being able to play a video in line and then being able to skip down to commissions or being skip being able to skip down to read a contract, right? We know what it's like otherwise. We have to download stuff or we got to scroll around. Like, this is just like, like this, right? Boop, look at it, back to it. Boop. So you're able to really consume a bunch of information. And I, I've seen people say, well, who in their right mind would read all of these 33 things? You're missing the point, right? The point is you're over delivering through customer experience and providing all the information. You go above and beyond. You don't just give them the PEA, right? You give them the about me. You give them your reviews. You give them, you give them everything that you can to build you up. So it's just like, dude, these, this person's a rock star. And then people start getting it. They're like, oh, I guess you're right. I mean, sure. Like I look at reviews sometimes, but if I was just worried about the PA, 
that, that's probably what I would be doing. And if I clicked on it three or four times, I would expect a call from you. Hey, notice you've been in the purchase agreement a few times. Do you have any additional questions, right? Being responsive, being reactive very, very quickly to things that people are doing is also very important because it's almost weird. How do you know that I was clicking on it, right? But I'm glad that you do. Yes. And that's what people need to understand. Yeah, that's brilliant. Good. And then, of course, you guys gave, uh, so the listeners down below, if you want to check out High Note, we've got a, a 20% discount link down below. So make sure you use that promotion. Special thanks to High Note. They gave that to me to give to you guys. So use that link down below. Um, so what else is what else is new in the world of High Note? You know, in terms of, you know, you've got the community building, you've got all these use cases starting to grow. Um, in the other video, we talked about how to set one up, how to copy someone else's and to take that and run with it. What else is kind of new in the world of High Note here in 2022? Sure. So one of the things that we're investing a lot of time, energy and money into is more templates, right? Making it even easier. So first of all, if you can use Instagram or you can use Facebook, you can use HiNote. You can copy a page, you can write something done, right? So it's a very, it's a very easy tool, but we want to make it better. So our goal is to be generating, you know, 100 to 500 new templates for our user community. So all kinds of different visuals, looks, feel. Now the user, all they have to do is drop in their video or drop in their referral, whatever it is that they want to drop in, they can do. One of the other things that we just added was a lead capture. So you can go in and you can add blocks into High Note, right? So you can schedule appointments, you can do all these things. Well, what about lead capture? Like what we're seeing people use it for, we're like, well, it should be there. So now you can just add a lead capture right into a High Note. And from there, you generate your own leads. So great use case scenario. We see this all the time, especially in real estate. People take their MLS link and they post it on Facebook, okay? Anybody that's clicked on one of those has a terrible experience, right? Because it's, it's the MLS listing thing. I don't, I don't know why they do this. You got to do this. You got to do this, right? So they put all of their stuff in the high note, and then they post that link in Facebook. So now somebody's able to click on that link, look at all the photos, right? Look at the virtual tour, the Matterport, the community information, the schools. I'm actually interested in looking at this house, doing lead generation from a simple post where that was not being done before. Um, real-time notifications. And there's some things that we're going to be doing on the back end, hopefully later this year or the following year, um, that allows you as the sender um, for your clients to be able to save their own high note presentations. So if you've been working with them from pre-listing all the way to post-closing, and then you're sending them their ancillary services, things like that, they could have all of their high notes compiled, right? So that they could see the entire journey, they have it, you know, they have their docs for their taxes at the end of the year, right? They keep logging in. Now, remember, when they keep logging in, you're getting notified, right? Great time to follow up. Great time to follow up. Great time to follow up, right? No, oh, maybe they're not going to log into your pre-listing stuff anymore. But they'll log into the other stuff, especially if you build them up properly. Yeah, very well done. Yeah, awesome. All right, guys. Well, drop down below. If you need more information about High Note, I have another video. So I'll, I'll link that up here so you guys can check that out where we kind of went through the very basics of it. But I encourage all of you guys, jump in, jump in the community with Randy, see all the templates and, and let your imagination go hog wild. Everybody has to right now shoot their housing market report and send that as a video prior to your listing appointments or else you guys are going to get killed on your listing appointments. So what better place to do that than in, in a high note so that we can make sure that we saw that they watched your video where you explain what's going on with the market. So, you know, it is really a powerful tool right now. Probably same thing for the buyer consultations and for new buyers that you guys are working with, explaining the market, handling some of those objections up front in advance in a, a great high note presentation that levels up your experience with the buyers today. So guys, get on this, join the community, and we look forward to checking in with you soon, Randy. And, and on the next show, let us know what's the latest. Awesome. Thanks for having me, man. Thanks for everybody that watched.